left America and went up through Andersonville, Logo Thorpe. Uh, we cut across over to Perry, came up through Macon. We stopped in uh, Gray and videoed. Uh, then we came down to Gordon, where we all this is where we made this video. Hello, everyone. This is Hubert from Traveling with Hubert, and I am Hubert, but I'm not the Hubert that this channel was named in honor of. Recently, Kathy and I went on a trip so that we could video some places. We rode through Macon. We did a drive-through video of that. We toured uh, Gray, Georgia. We did a driving tour of, of Gray. After we finished in Gray, we went south to Gordon, Georgia. We did a driving tour of Gordon, and this is that video. We hope that you like this video. If you do, we ask that you give us a thumbs up. Uh, YouTube likes to see that interaction between the viewers and the content creator. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, we invite you to do so. Just hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell and you'll be notified when we post a new video. We usually do that on Sunday mornings. If you are a subscriber already, thank you very much. We appreciate you watching the videos. We appreciate you taking time to, to subscribe. Thank you very much. If you have a comment, please leave it down in the comment section below the video description. Uh, if you know of someone that likes video, travel videos, and, and may like our video, uh, please share this video with them. And Kathy and I wish you have a very, very blessed day. We begin our trip tour of Gordon here at the Fall Line Freeway where it intersects with Georgia 18. And we came into town on this uh, on 18 until right here we got off on the Milledgeville Road. Uh, we came into downtown Gordon and we came through this uh, residential area, cut across back over to College Street, came back down into town, came across, went over here. Uh, went around this block and came back out, went back up here, and then we left town. I think I can make it to the right here, honey. Okay. I don't know where you go, where you go when you go that away. That way? Yeah. Milledgeville. Yeah. Right, City going? of Gordon, Gordon City Limit. I've been to Jefferson. No. It appears that they have inflated the city limits of Gordon like a lot of these other places have, honey. But it sure does look like, like a lot of open country right here. Apartments back there. Where do all these people work? They probably work with the kale and people, honey. Or either go out of town. Yeah, they go over to Macon. Macon's not that far away. Go to Milledgeville. They have the, see this big old mill up here? Mm -hmm. Business district. Go to the business district, honey. A little community right there. Okay, folks, I'm videoing. If y'all don't like it, you can go around or stop or do whatever. That's unusual. 
unusual. Uh, oh, yeah, that is an unusual house, huh? Stands out. It does. That one's unusual too, honey, because it's about to fall down. That's not too bad. Is it bad to live close to something like this? It's it, dusty. It, it used to be, honey. This used to all be covered in, in chalk dust. But the, you know, the EPA made them come in and clean it up, and you get a little bit, but it's not as bad as it used to be. It's been a long time since I've been over here. Yeah. It's a funeral, funeral home. Funeral home, yes. Post office, maybe? Yes, yeah. United States Post Office. That's the library. Yeah, Gordon Public Library. Must be a bank of some sort. Yeah. Really know where to go, honey. Huh? But we'll go around this block. Our block. Yeah. There's some kind of odds and ends, yeah. yeah. We'll go around the block and see what's down here. It's probably some residential. There's a family dollar down there. Okay, family dollar. If it's open, use your Texaco. Piggly Wiggly. Yeah, I think she told me they had a yeah. Piggly Wiggly up here. It's a nice Piggly Wiggly, honey, yeah. Well, at least they got a grocery store. Church over here on the right. Yeah. Health service Gordon, place. Gordon Church. Yeah. Methodist Church, Global Methodist Church. Go down one more street and then I'm going to... Here's your speed bone. Yeah. And they don't have a warning for it either. Ain't much of a bump, buddy. <laughs> that one looks like it might need some care. Either that or it's abandoned, honey. Well, there's a lot Empty. of them that need care, but they look like somebody's living in them. Yeah, that one didn't look like anybody was living in it. There's a Harris Walt sign. Going around the block. Uh, they got them up on blocks. Yeah. <laughs> Gosh, look at it. Yeah, some people live that way. Some pretty nice little communities, huh? Every once in a while you run across a place that really needs some care. College Street. They got some palm trees down there on their yard. Yeah, palm trees, yep. Yeah. Looks like they've got a trash bin there. They're doing something, cleaning it up. It's hard to say what they're doing when somebody's got so much in the yard. It is, but. It's what those those dumpsters like that are usually for when people are yeah. remodeling and stuff. Stop sign, honey. They got stop signs in this little place. There's your city hall. In Gordon City Hall, yes. This may be a church up here on the right. Gordon Lawrence Club. But yeah. Club that day, but I don't know if it's working. Dentist, R. Smith Family Dentistry. Yeah, that's First Baptist Church. Hmm. He's got him. I wonder what he's selling. I don't know. The old train station depot over there, honey. Yeah, we're gonna go. We gotta go down here and go across the road. Got them a can and the can am slingshot. Okay, I stopped again. Yep, there's the Texaco station. Yeah, 
Family Dollar down there. Yep, Family Dollar. Can I go down that way? I don't know, honey. Yeah. Oh, no. It's parking the other way. Yeah. Another thrift looking store, hardware store. Paper Mill Market, Paper Mill Market, United Steel Workers International Union, Local 90233. I can't tell what's There's going on. a food on. pantry back there. I think that's a water tank, honey. It looks like it. Yeah. Penn Chevrolet, or it used to be in. I'm trying to figure out why is all this, this salvage yard or something. Do not know, huh? Gordon Depot established 1885. Let's see what this says. Tell her she's pretty. Opening soon. Jelly elephant. I don't know what that is. Don't know either, honey. Bloodsworth Owner Shop, whatever that is. Let's see what else we can find. All right, I think it's your go, Mister. little snack shop. Yep. Yeah. That's what it looks like. Mm. Your fingers getting... I'm getting a cramp in my uh, hand, yes. Ripping. That's the funeral, funeral home. home, yes. People like to live like this, they just in their own little world, aren't they? Yes. It is an unusual house, honey. Where are you going from here? I'm going to get on the bypass and head south. Yeah. Those are my plans. A factory here. This plant. You want to know where folks work? This is it's where they work. One, and they, they, these KL and companies usually pay pretty good money. Yeah. In other words, somebody would drive up here to work here because yes. they make good money. Yes. They probably have night shift and everything. They, they probably doesn't ever shut in. I know the ones over at home don't. Yeah, I couldn't see him, honey. Yeah. And, uh, honey, I think that's going to do it for our tour of uh, Gordon, Georgia.